Hi everyone, welcome to AA Steam series. In this video, I'll show you how to animate your own sprite. And actually, these are letters. So yeah, let's get started. First, I'm gonna show you this. Wow. Enjoy. Thank you for watching. Hope you're having fun. And a whoop. <laughs> okay. So now let's go ahead and click on create. Create. <laughs> okay, so we don't need the boring old cat. So first, I'm gonna show you how you can find the sprite. So this is sort of a block, really, because it literally says block. It's a bit like a 3D, because you can see there's a shadow there. So there's that, and a glow, they say. So a glow. And this one. So you can see this one actually has more than one costume and they change color, which is pretty cool, right? So we're not gonna be using those today. We're gonna make our own. So paint. Hmm. So first let's go to text. And then I want this to be dark red. And I don't want a boring old writing. I want something like this, curly. Okay, so let's type in my name. A-R-Y-A-N. And let's make it bigger. Way bigger. Whee! <laughs> yeah, I think it needs to be a bit smaller. Just a tiny bit. There. And now, you could add something else. So, I don't know, I'm trying to keep it simple here, but you can do anything you want. But all I'm gonna do is just make an exclamation mark. For that, it's pretty easy. And I think I'm gonna wanna turn on outline. So I might make it yellow. Yeah, I think that might be a good yellow. And fill it in with orange. Yeah, that should be good. And make that line a little bit thick. I think five should be okay. And ta-da, it's way too big. Way too big. Make it smaller, smaller. And there we go. Yeah, definitely way more small. Audio hub preview. There, that actually should be the right size. Okay, next we need a circle at the bottom. Now move it right underneath that. And there we go. Pretty amazing. So let's move this there and this right there. Yay! So now we got the letters. There. And I think for what I'm gonna do, they need to be a little bit far apart. That should be good. Now, time for the code, the most important part of all. For that, I think nobody wants a boring old white background. So let's choose a nice backdrop. So you can choose anything you want, but let's see. I'm just gonna scroll through here. And that looks nice. Stars, cool. Audio hub okay. Now, time for the code, the most important part. 
find my new code. So I have all the stuff in my backpack. So I'm just gonna take it out and walk you through. Why does it always go to the corner? Anything that you take out for the backpack, it goes there or up here. I don't know why, but it does. So anyway, we got that. So it says, when green flag clicked, please sell meow until done. Meow. Meow. I don't think my name says meow. So let's make it a bit more exciting. We're gonna take this sound. So I'm just gonna leap off and big wing. <laughs> okay, so let's just keep it as big boing. And let's see what it sounds like. Pretty good, right? Yeah. So let's go to the code and switch it to big boing. Let's try it. Blah. What? <laughs> Again. Wee. I think they be a bit more further apart. Audio hub preview. And it won't look too good either. So I'm just gonna keep it in the middle, I guess. No other choice. So Wee! <laughs> that was fun! Okay, and for this one, we're just gonna bring out this. So it says, when green flag click, play a sound, magical spell until done. But we don't have that in the sounds. And I don't think I have a magical spell. So I'm just gonna close the backpack, delete this, and find a sprite. Or no. Hmm, I think I want to be a surprise. Surprise. And what is it? Now nah, another surprise. This is horrible. <laughs> surprise! Yeah, horrible. I don't think that whenever people choose surprise, they actually like it. Maybe they'll keep doing it until they find one that they like. Yeah, I think that worked for me. Keep on clicking surprise you. Find one that you like. I'm pretty sure that worked. Okay. A kid with a corner. Why do the codes like the corner so much? Okay. So, techno. There we go. But now, I realized something. But let me try it first. They all come at the same time. Whoa, what should I do? I think I know the solution to that problem. So first, let me just detach this code and see how long this takes. But we need to turn on timer. So I think it might be in the settings thing. And it is. Audio hub preview. And it started without me even knowing. Great, turn it off. Reset timer. Anywho. So let's start. Yeah, it took one second actually. I don't even know why I did that, but I did. So anyway, could you just put a wait one second block right there. Put it back together, click on it. Wow, genius. I'm amazing at this. <laughs> okay, but now, here's one thing. If you don't want it to just woof out of somewhere, you don't want to be automatic. You want it to just like play when you click it. So here's the solution. So go to events and drag out the when this bright click. Now let's try. Amazing, right? So I can do the same thing for this one. This one out. And why didn't that come along? And when this bright clicked. 
So I don't have to click the green flag now because it's when this bright is clicked. So I'm just click on it. Work. It worked. <laughs> See? And now I can do this one and this one. And this one again. And this one. And this one again. And this one again. This one again. And this one again. This is way more fun. <laughs> and I'm gonna stop. <laughs> Okay, that was good. And I'm just gonna bring this one back on. And this one, Put that off. Go back to control, and there we go. Back to the original. So that was pretty fun, right? And now you can have tons of fun with this actually. So it's pretty simple. So I'm just gonna save it, and there we go. So now, if you want, you can open it up here and then share, share it with everyone. But I think I might want to name it first before I share. So, um, hmm. I think I want to name it Dancing Letters. Dancing letters there and instructions really nothing. Audio hub so click and it's on the capital. Jeez, grammar. Click right. Click on the. Green flag, and I'm gonna add exclamation mark. And there we go. That's good. Totally better. Share. Yeah. Let's take a look at that. Oh yeah. What fun was that? So you can use this everywhere, really. So if there's a quiz, like, I don't know. Um, I can't even think of a question right now. Hmm. Audio hub I think this might be the time to buy forward. <laughs> so let's see. Um, so you can give out random options, like five, three, Two, if they click on the right one, they get one point. And you can put a score variable right there. And then if you click on the right one, it could be like a party noise or a pop. But if you get it wrong, you might like a boing or something. I don't know. So you can have lots of fun with it. You can make a quiz. And you know what? Instead of letters, you can use people. What fun. So yeah, I guess that's it. So yeah. I had tons of fun doing that. And check out all my Scratch videos. They're super fun. And my favorite one is the Dance Showdown. Let me just show it to you. To learn how to do this, when you see my dance video on Scratch, it's pretty cool. Be sure to check out all my videos. I have science, technology, engineering, art, and mathematics. They're super fun, and I hope you all enjoy them. So let's just dance with this. Oh yeah, oh yeah. What a way to end. Bye-bye.